Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Ascended. Uh, in this episode, in our last one, um, we have basically res rescued our Rex. We went back to Kano Island and we got him. And then now we have tamed up an Argentavis. Uh, this is, you know, he's pretty decent level. He's probably the highest level thing that we've tamed so far. So, um, not too bad. Um, his stats are okay. Nothing, nothing too crazy, but you know, nothing too bad as well. So I know I've been doing a fair bit of taming um, in these early episodes, but I kind of figure I may as well get the basics of everything to begin with, and then I can start like building and things like that later on. If you know what I mean, like as long as I've got all the main things that I need. So you know, like I've already got the Ankyo and things like that to get the metal. So this, in this episode, we will be doing a little bit more taming, but the idea is to show you how um, this trap base that I've made, how it can transform into many different styles of things. So the last time I had a roof on here, which allowed me to catch this RG, and then now, because I have an RG, I should be able to, I'm not too sure if this works, it used to work a lot a while ago, still got my death marker out there from when I died, um, I can't remember dying there, oh actually yeah, that's where we froze to death, might dismiss that, get rid of that death, act like that never happened, but yeah, over here, I remember showing you that um, little ball thing, I'm not too sure what it's called, but it's a little ball with a little tail. And they're excellent for collecting stone. Um, I'm pretty certain when you collect stone with them, they have like a, a weight thing where they don't, you know, it doesn't count as much on their weight. Don't ask me how they how it works with the how small he is. But yeah, so the idea is I'm pretty certain I've seen one over here somewhere. Might find one along the edge here too. So we'll just oh, so we'll just keep an eye out. Um, see this RG ain't too bad, I like the, the gold on his wings, looks pretty sweet. Alright, so usually you can find them along here, but we did see one, I think it was last episode or the episode before. I don't know if he's still going to be there, but he was just on the other side over here. So, we're going to try and grab him, hopefully without dying. And then what you can actually do is, because we took the roof off the trap, we can just drop him straight in there. It kind of makes it a bit easier to tame things. That's if we can still pick him up. Um, where is he? He was about here somewhere. Just land here for a second. Put our level in. Okay, so hopefully he's still here. Maybe he was further down. Uh, where is he? Not seeing him. Hopefully this isn't another one of those wild goose chases. Oh, there he is. See that little thing down there? That's what we want. So we'll just wait for the patchy to move out of the way. And what you can do is you should be able to swoop down, except with the raptor there. It's gonna be a little annoying. Swoop down. Uh, we'll grab this raptor maybe. Hold on. Need to need to deal with the raptor problem first. Oh, it's gonna crash. Why does it keep pausing like that? Kind of weird. So we get rid of them. Oh no. He's eating what? He's eating our buddy. Okay, we're gonna save him here. He should be alright anyway, but Let's see if we can grab him. Can we pick him up. Certainly can pick up raptors. Why can we not pick him up? Pick him up. Pick him up. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna land and mess him up. He's pretty high, but he isn't as high level as I was us. Let me just take care of him. And then. See if we can pick this guy up. I don't know why it's not grabbing him. 
No. Okay, so maybe we might need to bring the boat over. Possibly. Try doing it that way. I was certain you could pick these guys up. It's level 130, so the thing. So that's pretty good. Nah. Okay. New plan. New plan. Looks like we're going to have to bring the raft over. And, um... I think he does get aggro on you, so we can attract him in that way. Oh, ran out of stamina. This ain't gonna be good. This is also why it's always good to have a um a looking glass on you. So that way if you get stuck and he's in the air, you can always call him call him down, you know? So at least we know where that guy is. He's not too far away. And then yeah, we'll bring the raft up. Probably just leave the Rex there for now. He should be fine. Might even leave the RG there. I don't know about that. Yeah, he should be alright. We'll leave the RG there as well. And then, yeah, we'll just bring the raft over. Because I was certain you could pick him up, but maybe only once it's tame. Okay, it's getting a little cold. So that's not good. Um... We pick up these guys. Let's see. Sweep in. Nah. Maybe not. I was certain you could pick things up with this. Let's try a dodo. Nah. It's kind of weird. Maybe he's glitching out. So it's gonna land over here, looks pretty safe. Not too bad. Ooh, we've got some levels, we'll put we reckon in melee, a little bit of weight. Seems this guy, he will be carrying a bit later on, so, you know, he's good for that. It's good being able to fly. Finally in the air. Fortunately, I don't know why the grabbing mechanic just doesn't seem to be working too well. Either that, or I'm just not doing it correctly, I'm not too sure. But if I leave him with the Rex here, he, sh he should be pretty safe. Let's put him in front, so if anything tries to bite him, the Rex will pretty much just bite it straight away. Uh, make sure he's... can attack. Yeah, I think they're pretty good. It's gonna be freezing a little bit. Hopefully they don't die from that. Might need to go inside the building. But we'll move over there for now. And then, yeah. By the morning, possibly. We might have this guy. All depends how long he takes to tame. But I'm pretty certain he does get aggressive when you shoot him, so... Being that we've got a ramp on the front of this thing, we can just shoot him and then kite him up into it. Shut the door, you know. Basically the same thing as what we've done with the RG. But, yeah, I thought we could pick him up and drop him in. Oh, we're crashing. Huh? And the white keeps lagging like that. Kind of strange. I was playing on my PvP server, it wasn't doing that. So, might just be a single player problem, you know? Maybe because in PvP all the, all the stuff's gone, like all the trees and the rocks and the, you know, nothing's respawning because everyone's put foundations everywhere. These things look cool at night. Alright, so at least this guy, he ain't too far away, you know. Hopefully he doesn't take too long to tame up. Because, yeah, some of, these, <laughs> some of my episodes here have been stretching a bit longer than what I expected. Wouldn't mind getting a sea creature in the future, but... Yeah, I think after this one, after this tame, you might head back to base, and I might start doing more um, base-style builds, you know. 
because um, I think we've done a fair, fair bit of taming at the moment. We've got all, you know, like I said, we've got all the, the main things that we need. So we might head back there. And then, yeah, maybe in the next episode, we'll start doing a base, like a proper base build. I reckon that's, that's what we could be doing. And then, yeah, we'll find a nice area there to build. Wouldn't mind building on a river or something where it's real nice, but yeah. I don't know. We'll see, eh? We'll see. We'll see what we can find. We'll see a place that we can build. Is there a pillar over there? No, there's not. Okay, so if we were to build around this area, there's no pillars, are there? No. Nah. They're all at the other end of the map. So you're more... Yeah, you're probably best building over there because you're closer to the red pillar, closer to the volcano, closer to the green pillar, you know? Where if you built up in this area, yeah, you got the resources, but when it comes to the boss fights, now that you've got no cryopods, you have to walk everything a mile and a half away um, just to get into the fights. Where'd this guy go? Should be right here somewhere. Oh, there he is. Okay, so... Uh, we are kind of freezing to death. I might shut this door. we we'll shut that. And that should keep the cold in. We'll turn this fire on. Just to sort of heat us up a bit. And then... Yeah, we'll get prepared. Don't know how many arrows this guy's gonna need. We'll get our crossbows. But see, even with this low level stuff, as you can see, you know, I know we're boosted a bit and things like that, but you tend to be able to tame a lot of stuff. It just comes down to numbers. Whoa, okay. That ain't good. That is not good at all. See, that's where this trap comes in handy too, because. You can't really get to us if you don't break the door. So we might end up with a baryonyx here as well. <laughs> get out of the way, baryonyx. We're not here for you. Where'd he go? Where'd he run away? Come back. And he's out for the count. Okay, so if he was high level, we'd probably keep him, but he's only low level, so we just kill him. This can be one way to kill something that's a little bit difficult as well as, you know, you get in some safe place like this, knock him out, and then yeah, so I'm pretty certain this guy. Get him? Oh no. Damn bugs. Where are you? You're here? Okay, that's kind of weird. A sound glitch or something, maybe. Let's see, will, it, will he come after us? Yes, he does. Come on, buddy. Yeah, you want you want to kill me. You want to kill me. Look at me. I'm squishy, mate. I'm squishy. Hit me with your tail. No, 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 where you going? Where you going? Yeah, that's it. That's it. Come on. Yeah, you want you want to kill me, buddy. Follow me. Follow me. Keep it coming. Okay, so you don't want to hit him too much, because then he, he won't want to come in. Look, can he come in? Yep. Shut the door. Okay, so now you just get out of here, and bang! Got yourself another tame. And then you can use your house and that as backup in case, you know, something dangerous like that baryonyx comes. Okay, can we fit through the door? No, we can't. Oh, 
Alright, so hopefully it doesn't take too many arrows. Make sure I'm shooting him with Trank arrows. He's a pretty decent level, so he should be should be good for us in the future. Oh, he's running. He's running. It's when you know he's getting low. Come on, mate. Shouldn't be too much more. It really helps if you actually hit him. Stay still, buddy. Stay still. Come on. Gotta be close. Gee, um, you can take a bit. Doesn't like going to sleep, this guy. Pretty certain to say you tame them. Could be different, but I'm pretty certain. Hope it's not one of those passive tames, you know. Well, go to sleep. Go to sleep. Missed. We don't seem to be cold anymore, so that's that's a bonus. Ah. Stop moving around, buddy. Stop moving around. Make it easy for us. He's taking a lot of arrows. Not more than I thought he would. See, this is where it can get dangerous. Like, you know, if you're here too long, you have raptors and things like that running out of the bush. All it takes is one alpha and, you know, everything's going down. Oh, mate. There he goes. There he goes. Alright. The first thing's first. We move him away from the coast. We'll just bring him out a little bit. Enough to where if something would have chased us out of here, usually the sharks and that will, you know, they'll deal with him. Okay, probably about here should do. Oh, wait. It's one of those stupid birds here. Yeah, it might go a little bit further. Yeah, about there I should do. Okay, so I'm pretty certain this guy. He's kind of need a torch. It's a little dark. I think we've got one in here. Controller's kind of hard to use, I tell ya. Yeah, we do have one, it's almost broken. So, it's probably not even worth fixing it, but we'll fix it. Or not. Or not. not miss we're missing flint. If I could see, it would be awesome. No flint. Of course. Of course. Um. Right in here, yeah, definitely no flint. Well, looks like we're working in the dark. So we'll get that, get some of these. Um, any flint? No, it's not going to be flint. And there is the. Suppose we could run over to the bank there. Just whack that in, he's taming up. Okay, let's risk it for the biscuit. Wait. It's gonna glitch out. No. I just remembered that's a bad idea because there's, yeah, <laughs> all sorts of dangerous things in this water. If we make it back to the boat, I'll be surprised. 
That was a bad idea. That was a really bad idea. Well, we made it here, so we might make it back. Get ourselves some flint. Without getting eaten, it would be great. Oop. Got a bit, got a bit of light back. That's good. Okay, that should be enough. Wagon. To be plenty. Come on. Ooh, that ain't good. That ain't good. Maybe they'll leave us alone. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, nice. Okay, we'll put that flint in there. Fix that. And then we might as well put this metal in while we're here. Okay, we ran out of wood. Hopefully that didn't attack our thing. Sounds awfully close, doesn't it? We'll whack that in there, and then we should be able to... Yeah, bring out our torch. We'll put that on our belt. And we'll very carefully see where the hell that thing is. Quickly run out get onto the boat so he doesn't attack us. Yeah. And just like that. Oh yeah, he is a little bit close. We might move a bit more further away. Damn birds, man. They're everywhere. Like, like rats of the sky, I tell you. Little thieves. Okay, so what's this thing called? Dio. So... Um, can we unlock the saddle is the question or does he need a saddle yeah there we go so 200 Fiber, metal, stone. Yeah, we might actually have all that. How uh, do we make it on us? What's that saddle? No, that's not it. Trike. Um, nah, I think it's in here. Yeah. Missing fiber. Really? Yeah, GA. Okay, well, we might try to get some fiber. Looks safe enough over there. Safe enough. Alright, so let's get some fiber. It's not fiber. Could be, but no. Nah. We need another 20 fiber. It's a little freaked out over here, you know, like it can be um dangerous. Okay, that is not a bush.
And that should be plenty of fiber. Might take this guy out as well. Where's our um, torch? Do we break it? Huh. Okay, looks like you can't swim with a torch. Makes sense, but you know. Unless it's in here, actually. Ah, yeah, there it is. And there we go. We got ourselves a saddle. Let's put this back on our belt. And then, yeah, let's see, see what we got. Okay, so it's a female. 4,000 health. Geez, got a bit of health. Um, got a bit of weight, nothing crazy. Bit of melee. Hmm, yeah. He's alright. Uh, what's his efficiency at? 99.9. .9. Can't really get much better than that. Like, obviously, you could with kibble and things, probably get 100%. Um, yeah. And by the time he levels up, if he stays at that... Yeah, he should be pretty high level. But, um, this thing should be good and allow us to get uh, plenty of stone so we can build a pretty decent base. This is where our Bronto would be good like trying to get him back over because um, we could use him to collect the wood okay something's running down the beach there I don't like that hell's that uh, it's just them nothing too bad I might head back out in the ocean a bit So, oh, wrong button. In our next episode, while we're waiting for this guy to tame up, what we might do. See, we've got a fair few things now. We've got our Bronto. See, some of these things are kind of low level. Some of them aren't too bad. You know, pigs are only for like farming and that, so they don't really need to be too high level. Um, but yeah, so we're up here at the moment. The top right hand corner of the map. This is Kano Island where all the carnivores and stuff are. We could build up here but like I said all the pillars are um they're all down here. You know what I mean? So you got your green pillar like around here I think and this. You got your red pillar over here and then where's the other pillar? Oh yeah it's at the top of the snow. So, we do have to come back here for a cave. Do a cave run. But there's no... You know, like, we, if we built a base up here, we're going to have to walk all our rexes and things like that. All the way down here. Now there's no cryopods. All the way down to the, the pillars. Which is... It's a long way. It's a long way. Where if we build here, where everything is... We're gonna have resources and things around us that we're gonna that can, we can need. Um, I'm pretty certain there's a cave like right here, which would allow us to get plenty of chitin. And yeah, when it comes to the boss fights, we could build like a flat raft, sort of like what I had in some of the early episodes, and then just take him straight across here to the red pillar, like right here. Um. And then, yeah, just drop them off and walk them straight in. Be uh, pretty easy. And then same as this, you know, I know we can't come up the river. But, I suppose we could drop them off here and walk them up. Or we could just walk straight across here. Walk down the swamp. You know, or something like that. Because you've got like 10 Rexes. Nothing's messing with you. You know, like, nothing through there anyway. You might end up with a Spinal or something, but especially in this area. You'd end up with that spinos 
But yeah, so we can walk them up here and then around and down. So the only other problem is the snow, you know, like trying to get them up to the snow. But once again, we could probably raft them along the edge up here. Probably down to the bottom here because you don't want to go too far because you start running into whales and things like that. And then, even though it's dangerous here, once again, if we've got enough wrecks, it's not going to be too bad. And then we can just walk him straight up the mountain, you know? Find a path. And then, yeah. Get him that way. And do the same thing with this, with the volcano. Do the, um, because that's where your end boss is. And that's where your tech cave is. You mean, like, where the end boss is. So... If we build here, we could once again probably either walk through the swamp here and around the back of the redwoods, because you don't really want to go through the redwoods. I suppose you could, but... And then, yeah, you just go straight up the mountain and into the cave. So, I think if we're in a central location like this, it'll probably be best for everything, because, you know, that way we can go everywhere, where if you build up here or something, then we're going to have to take stuff all the way down here, all the way down there, all the way over here. And we've got to deal with all the dangerous creatures. So, at least down here on this little island thing, you're not going to have to run into too many bad creatures. You know, you got a few, but you run into occasional Kano, maybe a Spino on the river here. It could be a bit of a drama, but as long as you're up on the hill, you, you know, you ain't really have them walking up the hill. So, I think this is our best bet. We might build, like, at the back here, just uh, above the swamp not too close where the snakes and that can come up but yeah I think we've got a spot in mind and that will allow us to get all the metal that's down the side here the metal on top and crystal um when it comes to polymer there are those little guys down here that you can smack with a bat and get polymer from them there's cementing paste on this side cementing paste over here like in this little switch for some reason, but yeah, over here. So, yeah, I think probably about this location here is probably our best bet. Oh, it's morning. How's this guy going? He's getting there, he's getting there. This is going to be another longer episode of what I thought. Shouldn't be too bad though, and it shouldn't be as long as the first, like the other two, getting the Rex and the RG. But after this, after this one, I think we, we've done enough taming for now. Done enough taming. We'll go on to our base build. We'll build a, something a bit better than what we got just here, you know, like, this is your basics. This is like my, um, my getaway ship, you know got enough to survive but yeah you could build it into a full-fledged base but you start running out of um build limit so you can't add that much to it for starters and then secondly you know it's good being able to move it around but it moves quite slow and yeah we just want something a bit more stable you know somewhere where we can start farming getting kibble made that sort of thing you know because um now that we've got the basics, we, we want to start moving up into the area where we can we can start taming things to get um, the artifacts and stuff like that, you know? Start getting some metal armor. Fully move up into the metal age. I don't think we'll make a metal base. Ooh. Hold on. Sorry about that. Had a um, bit of a call. Might just put that on silent, actually. Okay. So. Yeah, this guy shouldn't... It'll take a little bit longer, but it shouldn't take too much. Once again, we don't want to move too far. 
Even though the RG spawned in here, doesn't mean this guy will, you know? So, I would skip the stuff out of the videos, you know, like the waiting for it to tame up and stuff. But yeah, sometimes it's, you know, people want to see this sort of stuff. I want to know, you know, I know it's boosted, so it's not like the real taming amount. You know, otherwise we'd be sitting here all day. But, um, yeah, you know, it's part of the game. It's part of the game. So, unfortunately, there's not much we can really do while we're waiting. But, yeah, it is what it is. What are these things? Alarms, eh? Okay. I wonder if they're a one-off thing. These two near each other create alarm trap. Hmm. You're not too sure if they're different things. See, we can use this at our base to start getting water. Um, because up on the mountain there, you're not going to have water, but... You add one of these, when it rains, you have a constant water supply. That's right, we were making a shotgun at one stage, weren't we? I suppose we could look into that. Uh, weapons, firearm. Yeah, look, we can make this now. So... Should we make a shotgun? Should we make a long neck? I reckon we'll make a shotgun, because we've already got bullets for that. What do we need here? Just more metal. Yeah, we've got more metal right here. How come this is going out? Now oh well, may as well make both. Bar, um, okay, so we've got a long neck and a shotgun. Uh, we want our gunpowder. So... Make some more of that. Probably have more ash laying around. Certainly got a bit more flint. Need a bigger one of these. Oh, I want that. There we go, so that's, it's getting up a bit better. Um, can we make some of these? And chuck that in there, grab the meat out. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Oh, leveled up. Put the meat in. Make some more narcotics. Okay, so... Don't know if we're going to need them anytime soon, but... We'll make more anyway. And then... What else can we make? Probably take these ones out. And we can chuck the flint in. Make a bit more spark powder, because... We're going to need a bit of ammo. Especially like when we start doing cave runs and stuff, you know? You want it, you want that ammo. Um... Where'd the flint go? It was in here. Yeah, see how slow it is to move stuff across? It just... I kind of wish there was a faster way to move, like, the whole lot with controller. We can have a shot swimming awfully close to us. How deep is it here? No whale can get us here. Alright. Hope not. So what do we got? We got a shotgun. Um we got our long neck, which I'll just chuck that in there for now. We should be able to make ammo, maybe? Weapons, ammo. So you need three pellets to make, and some gunpowder to make that. 
They need gun pad. Whoa. Okay. They're, they're expensive, man. They're expensive. So. We will make. Make a bunch of them. And once that's done, we should have more metal gunpowder. And then we can make some more shotgun bullets. Whack this in here. See how much hide we got. So we've got a bit. We might make some... Grab the wood out. And then we'll keep cooking this. And then we should be able to make some metal armor, I reckon. Possibly. Yeah, so I wonder how many bullets you get. Let's see, what's the gunpowder? Yeah, not looking too bad, not looking too bad. How come we can't make spark powder? It's kind of weird. Oh, it's already getting made. Let's see. Okay, back into weapons, ammo. Shotgun bullets. So let's see. Yeah, so this is a few. Not as much as what I thought you'd get. <laughs> okay, so they're expensive to make, so they must be pretty pretty good to use oh, it's double barrel that's cool nah shouldn't waste it <laughs> we won't waste it actually what level is that guy where'd you go mate Stay still. And, yep, he ain't worth taming. He ain't worth taming. Okay, so it seems like the higher the level these guys are, much longer you gotta wait. Still gotta wait for a bit, you know? It's like it's almost night time. What day is it anyway? Day six, gee. For day six, you know, we're doing all right. We're doing all right, I reckon. Not doing too bad. We've come a long way. Um, see what else we need here. See, Behemoth Gate should be good. Expensive, but good. Scope attachment. I can't remember unlocking that. Water tap. We'll unlock that. Because that'll be good for our garden later on. Um. What else we got? got lamps. Flashlight attachment. Yeah, that could be handy. These we'll need later. Oh, do we? Like, do we need... We really need a Giga or something like that. It'd be good to tame one, but... I don't think you can fit them in the... In the caves, anyway. Um... I mind making one of these. Looks pretty expensive, but it'd be pretty cool. You know? Might look into that later. What is this? I've never seen that before. Ah, uh, that's one of the new creatures. That's part of the new creatures. So that mod is definitely active. Bronto saddle. We might unlock that. That way we can at least ride our Bronto. What's this? Taming dino to boost lost taming efficiency. Okay, I've never seen that before. 
Um, Spino Saddle. Brachiosaurus. Ooh. It's one of the new creatures. Might end up going after them in the future. What else we got here? Bronto Platform. Gas Mask. I think you need that to go into one of the caves in the future. Almost at rocket launches, eh? See, we're certainly going up in the levels. That's for sure. So, it shouldn't be too much longer. Fortunately, these guys are taking a little longer to tame than what I'd like, but. What's the level Z trash? We'll keep our eyes out. We don't really want to be doing too much more taming at the moment. I think we've done enough. But, you know, if we see something that's crazy, then we're prepared to get it, you know? We've got everything. So, just in case. Um, okay, so we got our shotgun. Might try this metal armor next. Don't have too much metal. Now I think about it. But yeah, we'll see what we can make anyway. We'll start off with the vest, the pants, and the helmet. Try the feet and the arms. Nice. We've been up in the world. Yeah, so we're looking a little more armed up now, you know, a little bit better. Why does it keep saying that server glitch? That's kind of weird. Uh, we might put this stuff in here. We'll keep the bullets on us. Just in case. You never know when you're going to need it. Almost ran in the fire then. And then yeah. Have a look. Nice. Just as we level up too. Um, yeah, we might put one in weight. Because we're going to be building next. So. Might as well. I think that just unlock the rocket launcher which you know I don't think we really need but it'd be good to have night vision goggles that's that's crazy so yeah we're certainly coming up in the levels gotten far in six days six days and I think what, eight episodes or something? How's this guy going? Yeah, it looks like maybe one more. One more and he'll be good. I'll give him a bit more just in case. Back out in there, we'll grab the saddle. Alright, so... This guy's probably going to tame up soon. Um, we'll put a saddle on him. And, um, you know, have a look at his stats and stuff. And then, yeah, in the next episode, I'll probably um, I'll cruise back to the base before the next episode. Just so, you know, you have to watch the drag of, you know, cruising back. Um, I'll take all my stuff back, the RG and the Rex and everything. And then, yeah, we might start a build series. You know I mean we might start building our base see what we can do like you know I ain't the best at building you know as you can see like you know I, I get it done I get it done but yeah we'll see what we can come up with hopefully something a little bit artistic but you know yeah I ain't I ain't the greatest I ain't the greatest so but we will do a bit of a build series and um yeah we'll see what we can build 
we'll, we'll start making our, our base anyway, getting a, getting a home, you know? Getting a home happen. We'll um, start adding in some of the, um, the bigger things, like the, the cookers and things like that, you know? Just to make life a bit easier for us. And then, yeah, from then, uh, we'll just continue on. Hopefully, we might start hitting up caves or something. Or um, we might need to tame up something for that, like a frog or, you know, something like that to start hitting up a few caves. And, yeah, we'll start chasing these artifacts, I reckon. You know, so over the next few episodes, it should get quite interesting. Um, there'll be a lot to learn, that's for sure. Like, I've done it before, but, you know, it's been a while. It's been a while since I've done it all, so, and it's all changed in this, you know, new ASA. So, we'll have to try, you know, have to learn how to do it again. It's been a while. It's been a while. Um, I know where some of the caves are. I can't remember where all of them are. So, um, we might have to look that up. And, you know, look up probably the best ways to go through it and stuff, but we'll do it. We'll do it. A nice big shark down there. And then, yeah, so this guy shouldn't be too much longer. I think the next, next bite he takes, he should be good. And at least, you know, he's a decent level. So, shouldn't end up with no dramas. What is that? Just white. Yeah, we don't want a white drop. White's like your, your lowest drop, you know. And uh, we don't have our RG on us anyway, he's over there. And in the future too, I wouldn't mind finding out if someone knows how to get this Bronto safely across from uh, Herbivore Island, that would be great. Because, um, yeah, I tried to put him on a raft and he just wouldn't go on. Now I tried to put a platform on the raft and all sorts of stuff. So... You know, unless we just go ahead and tame one on the mainland, you know, or something like that. That could be an opportunity, because he's not very high level anyway. Like, uh, when you look at him, he's, what, uh, level 23, you know, so he ain't the greatest. He ain't the greatest. So it doesn't really matter if we do have to leave him behind, but it would just be handy, especially with this build series, you know. It would be super handy. Hmm. Yeah, I might, might try taming another one, possibly. But, yeah. Might do that in between series, you know, just so that way you just don't have to hang around for that, because we already tamed one up before. Unless you just want to see it, but, you know. Um, we'll just see how it goes. This guy, still not done. Gee. It takes, takes a lot longer than I thought it would. Okay, so a small episode turned into another episode. These episodes just keep getting longer and longer. <laughs> uh, hopefully, yeah, we'll keep them a bit shorter in the future. Especially once we start getting into the build series and stuff. You know, we can, we can control the situation a bit better. See, I'd drive back, like, if I knew you'd stay in there. Oh, there he goes. Nice. How come the bar's still there? Kind of weird. Another glitch. <laughs> yeah, so this guy is good for, um, he can do this. See? Get the, get the roll on, which comes pretty handy. And then, yeah, you can just use his tail. And get stone. You know what I mean? Handy creature. Real handy creature to have. But, yeah, we might leave it at that. So, you know, I hope you all like that, you know. It has taken a little bit long to get some of these starter creatures. But, yeah. We're there now, so we can get onto the build series. So, like, subscribe. All that good stuff. And, I'll see you in the next one.